What's up fellow K-pop fans? I am here and I'm ready to react to some NCT that I've missed because I've missed quite a bit for the past like month or so. So in this video, we're gonna be checking out Wave V. We're gonna be checking out NCT Dream with Harvey and we're gonna check out NCT 127 Superhuman because I've missed those and I want to react to them for you all. Before we get into it, you guys, if you haven't subscribed yet, Hit subscribe so that way you can see more videos in the future. Another thing for you guys to check out is our Twitch. I want you to check that out because we do live streams, K-pop streams over there, and it's a lot of fun. Also, if you want to follow us on our social media accounts, if you want to keep up with our daily lives and see what's going on, we have all of our social media down in the description down below, and also they pop up here. You can check out some really cool things that we've done recently, actually. I've had a gig with a new band. We posted some stuff on Instagram, Maggie on hers, and also on mine. We went to a car show, you guys. It, you check out my Instagram because there is this we saw some really beautiful cars, but there's one that I really loved, and you got to check out this classic car that looks gorgeous and it's like a cream and purple color. Isn't it beautiful, Maggie? Really loved it. Anyways, ladies and gentlemen of the Dreamerverse, without any further ado, I know you want these NCT reactions and you're gonna get them. So let's dive into NCT right now. So the Chinese NCT Wave V and this song is called Take Off. And click. I like that bass synth. It's a little farty sounding. I like those stabs, the strings. That's cool. Really strong hip hop vibe. Whoa, that's awesome looking. Some of the graphics in this remind me of Cherry Bomb a little bit. Which I love that. And also like the airplane. Like where they're dancing and stuff there. Wow, that guitar, the, the distortion on it was really heavy and there's a lot of reverb on it too. I like that jacket. Sexy, dude. Painted himself. <laughs> oh shit, dude! Oh, that's sick, dude! Oh my god! That's insane how heavy that got there, and the dancing was sexy with it. Oh my god. Did you hear that synth in the background there? It sounded like an arcade. Oh, 
badass, dude. Ooh, I love those vocals. Beautiful vocals right there. Can't get over how heavy that guitar is, man. That was awesome. Loved it. I was surprised how heavy the guitars got there. Like, they got really heavy and loud. Loved it. It's really sick because it looked so cool. It was such a great coupling with the choreography and how heavy that riff was. Just, oh, 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 oh. oh man, that was sick. All right, you guys, cool. Let's move on to NCT 127 Superhuman. Also, I love Ten's jacket, that yellow leather jacket. Pretty sick. And click. That's a lot of synthesizers. Oh, gorgeous. Yeah. Oh, this is awesome. That intro was sick, man. This is so funky, man. It reminds me of a little bit of a Daft Punk vibe, you know, with that tech, that techno-y, funky kind of mix. Ooh. My God, just some really beautiful vocals going on in this. Like, this major melody right here is so happy and sexy at the same time. I love it. It's so clean sounding. I also love this the fact that they're they're putting a lot of rests in for the drums and stuff. It's nice to have that space and uh, to let the vocals really pop, you know. Love that bass line. Boom, 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 boom. That was interesting. I love that. Dude. Oh my god, I love the harmonies here. Like the melody is just so beautiful and the harmonies just really top it off. Ooh, it's so good, dude. It's so dancey and funky. The punchiness of that kick drum is sick. It just gets you going, you know? It's perfect. Cool, that looks so sick. Can't get over the punchiness of that kick. It sounds really good. 
Wow. The vocal harmonies, man. Hold on. I, I just want to go back to the beginning because it sounded so good. I love the set design, too, of the music video. It's got that, um, what is it, Vapor, vapor Wave or Retro Wave, however. I, I don't know what that style is called. I can't think of it right now. Like, it, it's got that 80s futuristic kind of vibe to it. I love and it's so cool and the sound matches it too that the synthesizers match that um, feel So okay the harmonies in the beginning there so sick. I really love them. They sound so good so clear um, so in tune and oh my god, it just sounds really damn good And then right here. I really like the ducking that's going on. There's like it might be side chaining um, Which is technique basically it's done with the compression. I, I think I've talked about this before because it, it, it's a popular um, Thing to do in EDM music um, It's a popular technique for EDM music But basically what's going on with a side chain is it's running through a compression So you have a kick hitting and every hit it signals the compression to duck the um, synthesizer, whatever you're 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 linking it up with for the side chain, and they did that here, I believe, with the synthesizer. If not, then they did maybe did an automation um, in order to create that volume swell. But I love the way it sounds. Yeah, Ooh, I really love that. Yeah. Tons of reverb on those snaps. Sounds like it's in a humongous room. Honestly, though, seriously, absolutely fabulous song. Really love this. Um, to me, it sounds different from NCT 127, the songs that we've heard so far. Um, it still has their vibe, but there's a little bit more funk in this song. It's a little more funky, and I, I really love that because it just makes you want to move, man. There, there's something about funk that has that... It's just that groove that, that just makes you want to move. It makes you happy, you know. Fantastic song. Really love this song. Um, definitely adding this to my playlist because I like it a lot. Okay, so now we're going to move on to NCT Dream and Harvey, I believe. Uh, Don't Need Your Love. Station. <laughs> <laughs> That's cute. I'm going to call this EDM guitar. You hear that guitar in a lot of EDM songs. Tons of echo, reverb. Very clean electric guitar. A good voice. I don't think I've heard of him before. Nice. If you think I'm gonna come back, I won't. I don't need your love. Cute. He's got a little bit of uh, Justin Bieber vibe, a little bit. Kind of like his later, uh, his latest stuff that he's done, uh, genre-wise. Crush the heart. I like the tone of his voice. I'm trying to think of who it reminds me of. Someone sings with that same kind of vocal technique. Oh! I 
that's cool, man. If you guys hear that high harmony in there, it's just an octave. It, it's doubling the uh, the lead melody, which is so cool. It gives it a nice, it fills it out a lot. <laughs> if you're waiting for a comeback, hold on. I don't need you. Oh, cute. And I keep on eating all sick. Oh, yeah. I don't need your love. I really love his voice. A lot of texture. Oh, that was so cute. <laughs> I want a pink blazer. That's really cool looking, man. That was beautiful, man. I really liked it. Um, it really does remind me of like Justin Bieber. It, the last couple songs that he's come out with kind of have this EDM vibe to it, but it's really poppy and happy, you know, um, it, which is really cool. And I, I like Justin Bieber's songs that he's come out with uh, past couple years, really. Anyways, I, I liked the song and I, um, I really loved, I mean, all the guys' vocals sound really great. Seriously, very, very great. But there's... Yeah, yeah, yeah him he's got a really nice low tenor bass vocal going on here but i love the breathiness of his vocal and just the tone of his vocal too it almost sounds like he's like putting his tongue in the back of his throat and singing kind of a thing that's that's what it makes me feel like there's a couple of korean singers that kind of use this technique and I I really like it. I think it sounds really cool and unique to them too. You know what I mean? It, it, it's not like they all sound alike doing that, but I just like the way that sounds. I don't know. It's just, it's just a nice tone and it, it's really different. It's very different sounding. And I just feel like it stands out so much uh, in a good way. Um, I also want to say, I don't know Harvey, to be honest with you. I don't, but he's a good looking guy, really nice vocal. And I, it's really cool that I feel like NCT Dream and Harvey, they fit really well together. Like, it, it it seemed like they were a group, you know what I mean? Which I think is really cool. Like, when they were dancing together and stuff, it just seemed like a group. And it really does. It feels like they're a group together. They did a really good job in this. And uh, the visuals are really awesome, too. Like, I love these pink outfits. That's sick, man. That's so cool. Really love it. Beautiful vocals, man. Really beautiful vocals and great mixing. Loved it. Love checking these out, you guys. Hopefully you had fun checking out this video. I don't know how long we went here. About 20 minutes. But 20 minutes, three music videos, that's pretty good, I think. But hopefully you guys enjoyed it. I enjoyed it a lot. Definitely going to be adding Superhuman to my playlist after I'm done recording because I can jam out to that, man. That's, that's a fun song. That's a fun song. I liked all three of them, but that's probably my favorite out of the three, to be honest. But I do like all three of them. Really good stuff. Love you, dreamers. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did, share it with your friends and leave me a comment down below. Let me know how you're doing, man. Hopefully you're doing okay. I haven't uh, talked to you guys in a while, so hopefully everything's going good with you. Um, if it's not, hopefully it will be um, soon, all right? Things will get better if things aren't good. I promise. They do. Yeah. Anyways, dreamers, keep on dreaming. We'll see you in the next video. And until then, on Yong. Bye.